Alex George earned himself a bevy of loyal followers as the unlucky in love a. The 27-year-old doctor got into a heated row with Ellie, 20, on last night's episode of Love Island after she revealed they had no sexual chemistry, Ellie confided in her fellow contestants during the start of the show, revealing, I'll tell you totally how I feel. I came into this villa really wanting to get to know Alex, because I was like, do you know what, he will treat me so nice. He's such a sweetheart, speaking directly to Megan Barton Hansen, she added, no offense I was looking at you thinking, why does nobody like him, I couldn't get it. Then I've come into the villa, and I was like, I kind of, get it, Megan, who ITV viewers will remember chose. Al Booker over Alex, replied, I completely get what you're saying because that's how I felt. My head and my heart were saying, go with him, he's a gentleman, he'll treat you exactly what you haven't had, he'll be the ultimate gentleman, he's a lovely person. When Alex discovered Ellie had been talking about him with the other contestant he lost it and spat, I think she's being rude at the moment. She's very rude, very rude. I wouldn't treat someone like this. Absolutely not. I am very annoyed, venting in the beach hut. Alex fumed. I want to have a conversation with Ellie because there's a few things I've noted since the recoupling. She hasn't really spoken to me. She's made no effort outside of challenges or dates that we've been put on. I think she's been rude at times as well. I think she's not the person I thought she was. I just wonder whether people would think that what she's doing is playing games. I'm just throwing that out there. I just wonder if that's a possibility. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe that's unfair, but until I speak to her I don't think I'll know that answer. So yeah, we need to speak. But as far as I'm concerned, she's not the person I thought she was. Ellie eventually sat down with Alex and told him she felt very awkward around him and had hoped they would work. She explained, I don't think there's any sexual chemistry between us. I'm sitting here now ending something with somebody who I know has got a kind heart, I know is genuine and it hasn't been an easy thing for me to do, so yeah. In later scenes, the conversation quickly descended into a full-on dispute as Alex aired his grievances towards Ellie. It is possible. This shocking moment leads some celebrity fans to turn their backs on Alex and criticize his behavior. Comedian London Hughes led the group of stars in slamming Alex on Twitter. With her writing, Alex is super entitled. I feel like he just goes for every new girl that goes on the show simply because he believes it's his turn. Ellie doesn't actually owe him anything, but let's be clear that girl still played him like a Nintendo DS Lite. Reality star Chanel McCleary added, Alex is acting like one of them guys who pops up in your messages telling you you're beautiful then calls you ASL asterisk asterisk when you don't reply. Social media influencer Louis said, I'm sick of the Alex pity party. Ellie can change her mind the poor girl probably didn't realize his personality was the equivalent of a wet leaf until she coupled up with him. Meanwhile, professional rugby player Rob Evans joked, five retweets and I'm going to apply for Love Island and give Ellie the man she's looking for. Presenter tweeted, wow Alex, after all this time I've been riding for you it turns out you're actually a little gossip and drama king. Love Island continues tonight on ITV2 at 9pm.